stuff. So let me switch the camera around. I might have to take a crap while I'm here. Uh, let's see here. Let me turn the camera. There we go. All right, this first box is really heavy, and we are going to see what's in here. I got several more boxes out in the car, so those of y'all who are into lighting stuff are probably going to enjoy this. I'm sure someone will come on. I hope this thing is public. I'll find out here. There we go. People are coming on. Anyway, we are going to... I kind of wish I had a knife. Like I said, those of y'all who follow my lighting videos are really going to enjoy this unboxing because this is not elevator-related stuff. It's cooler than elevators. I'll be honest with you. Those of y'all who know me real well know that I enjoy my lighting more than I do elevators. But... This package right here, I don't believe is an, I don't know, let's see, is this an eBay item? I think this is an eBay item, and I'm going to tell you something. This seller charged me $100 shipping on this, and he packaged it well. We got two, that'll be, that can be unbent. We got two new ballasts here. Let me get them out. Yeah, those can easily be unbent. It's not, it's common for these tabs to get bent. But look at these ballasts we got. I'm gonna take the cellophane off them. Then we'll get the pliers and unbend the tabs. Look at this ballast here. This is beautiful. It is a universal Preheat ballast for two F40 T12 lamps. And hey, Jared, let me go get my pliers so I can unbend these tabs real quick. got some more stuff out in the car. Let's just unbend these tabs real quick. There we go, because that happens to these old ballasts. There we go. Tabs are flat now. New old stock ballasts. Here's another one. He did wrap them well, and he did, uh, Package them well, but he charged $100 shipping, which is outrageous. Let's unbend this tab right here. See, the tabs get bent on these sometimes in storage. There we go. As good as new. See? Got to do the same to the other side. I mean, it's annoying that this happens to these ballasts, but when they're stored for a long time, sometimes they may get jostled on their end. There we go. These ballasts are as good as new now and ready to be mounted. I got these so I can have... I also got some more stuff in the car I gotta go get. Let's see what's in this package right here. This came from, I believe, eBay. It's very light, so I, I don't remember what it is. But we'll find out here soon. We'll find out here... We don't know what we're unboxing in this package. This one right here is, let us see, really well packaged. Oh, it's light bulbs. I got some new old stock Philips Westinghouse F13T8s. 
Uh, I hope you stick around. I mean, I'm still fun. <laughs> so these will go downstairs. New light bulbs. They arrived in one piece. Really well packaged. All right, let's see what's in here. I think this is another ballast. I'm pretty sure this is another ballast. Here we go. Yep, advance. Yeah, I'm stocking up on these things because I'm going to tell you, here in the not so distant, I mean, these things are already discontinued. So if you like preheat fluorescent, you better stock up on your ballasts. Because if you have one go bad a few years from now, you ain't going to be able to get these. It's rare for a ballast to go bad, though. Magnetic like this. Let's see what kind this one is. Oh, it's got bent tabs again. This one is for one F40 T12, F30 T8 or T12, or, or a circle line. And it looks like this one was actually used because you can see the wire here is very short. And we're going to have to unbend a tab on this again. And look how short that blue wire is. We're going to have to attach another wire to it. But this ballast is still more than usable. All I have to do is trim some of this off. I'll be right back. I got more stuff to do on the car. I believe this ballast is used. So there's another ballast. I'm going out to the car. I'll be right back. I gotta get another package. tell you is like an oven outside this came from my Facebook friend Austin and this one we're just going to tear open because we got several items in here oh wow this one's pretty this is for 230 watt t8 lamps the ballast stock up in this or right, let's check out this one I hope this one didn't get damaged oh wow General Electric for two F40 T12 lamps again what's with these short wires I think this one was used this ballast was used again all I have to do is just trim this one wire and it's good to go I think we have one more in here I can't tell don't want to dox them. But yeah, Austin, Facebook friend Austin sent me these. I know there's one more in here. I feel it. It's heavy. 
but I don't, oh, it's under here. He packaged them decently well. This is the one I think on it, that GE one. And then we have, this one's used, I believe. We have another old universal ballast for two F20 T12 lamps. So we have a total of six ballasts here. Let me pick up my trash. Yeah, I'm not gonna be out here long because there's only 22 people in here. We have six ballasts here. It's a shame, I miss when I used to get a lot of people on here. It was a lot of fun, but. Mm. We're gonna get rid of this trash. And look at this. I don't know if I've shown you all this. This came from a building in Chicago. So yeah, that's the Otis panel. Th these are the panels that cover up my electrical wires. But yeah, we got six ballasts and some bulbs. And Austin, if you are on this live stream, yes, I did get your ballasts. They are right here. They are right there. And now I can reballast these. And uh, I got another light fixture, the Habitat Store. It's just a 2F20 T12 fixture. But yeah, this has an alarm in it. If I ring it like that, I'll get a notification from my Alexa saying a smoke alarm is going off. But since there's only 18 people on here, I'm probably going to hop off here. I got some other stuff to do since not very many people want to come on here and talk to me today. But I do love you guys. Um, uh, I got to put this stuff away. And yeah, um, everything has been going good. It is so hot out here. I need to get Nick over here to mow my grass. But I need to get more people on here. Let's see here. Wi-Fi may drop when I go out here, but I'm going to show you all something I got. And we're going to bring it inside. Got this at the Habitat store for five bucks. An old desk light. Put it on my pinky for now. This guy right here, old GE bulb too. So we're gonna take it in here and set it up. Yep, the Hyundai is back. My doorknob needs to be crazy glued. The decorative doorknob came off. Oh, it is cool in here because I cranked these air conditioners. We're gonna have one desk light for each bed now. You bugs. I put this desk light on this side. This is my, yeah, five bucks. Look at that. Hold on. I'm just gonna unravel the cord and plug it in because it does work. This guy will need new ballast. Plug it in the light, bear with me guys. Just bear with me for a minute. <clears throat> this light works perfect. Here we go, watch this. 10 people on, all right, it's time to go. People are leaving. Hold it down, and it lights up. But anyway, since people are leaving, I'm gonna hop off here. I hope y'all have a good day. Sorry I didn't stay on longer, but people are leaving, so I'm just going to hop off. All right, well, y'all have a good day, and I'll try streaming again sometime later, and maybe we can get some more 
this is weird. People are, people are coming and going. Now we just got to clean up this mess here and put these ballasts and bulbs away. That's one thing. I'll, I'll give you all a brief tour of my house here in a minute. If y'all want to see a brief tour of my house after I pick up this trash, I will do that. It's going to involve a couple trips to the recycle bin out back. So I'm going to recycle all this cardboard and plastic. Now, when we go outside, we may drop and switch to Wi-Fi or to LTE, so just bear with me. Ugh. We may get on the LTE here. This is my backyard. Oh, internet errors. There, this is my recycle bin. I'll give y'all a tour of my house after I get this trash out. And these ballasts put in the fluorescent lighting laboratory. Plastic is recyclable. Oh yeah, and I got these little guys for my Sylvania. So yeah, I think that's all the trash. Like I said, I've become really an OCD about keeping this house clean. That's why this irks me here. Now it detects motion. My back door camera wasn't detecting motion, but it is a freaking sauna out here, guys. And I just bought a dehumidifier. I don't even want to go down that basement. It's so nasty right now until I get the dehumidifier installed. Whoa, wait a minute. The carry rail, rail fan, awesome. Have I met you before, the carry rail fan? And you said you met Jim today. I don't know if I've met the carry rail fan before, but thank you for the super chat. Thank you for the super chat. Thank you, really, thank you, really, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yep, my back door is, so, uh, I thought something was wrong with my camera, but it's picking up motion just fine now. Now that I adjusted its sensitivity. Yeah, we got people here now. And we're gonna put these ballasts away a couple at a time. Yeah, less than that. I'm about to hit 96,000. So like I said, now that I got people on here, I'm gonna humbly ask you guys a big favor. Please share my channel with just one person you know. If you can get one person you know to subscribe to this channel, um, it'll help us get our silver play button soon. So when we get the silver play button, we're gonna do something big. A giveaway, we'll, we'll do something. We'll do something to show the fans how much we appreciate them. Because I really do. I really do appreciate you guys. Ugh, a carry rail fan, have I met you? Your name sounds familiar. All right, we're moving these ballasts to the other room, and then I will give you a tour. Ryan, hello, how are you doing? Haven't seen you in a little bit. Good to see you, buddy. We're just moving ballasts right now. <clears throat> Cause I'm OCD about the cleanliness of my house. I just think I got two more trips to make. 
This thing gets really loud. There we go. I'll be on later.